I'm Alex. And I'm Teddy. And I'm Spencer. And we are the, the Button, Button Mappers. Hey, the Button Mappers. <laughs> I have to find the I have to find the best Kirby. You are the best Kirby. Oh, thank you. Hold on, I think I have it. Since I, I'm not gonna be able to put on the camera this episode, so I'm gonna. I have to find the best picture to use for this episode. Yeah. Okay. Well, do hurry because we I I did say we're recording. Oh, hold on, I have it right here. This this is it. This is the one. There we go. That's that, that's, that's a good one. one. Yep. That's Kirby. That's Kirby if I ever saw him. That's him. I think he's Muscle Kirby. That was the mascot, I think, for 2023 or 22. One of those. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Ripped Ripped Kirby was terrifying, too. But this, this one has the realistic feet. I think that's yeah. even worse. Ripped Kirby or ribbed Kirby? Ripped. Ribbed? ribbed. Really, like, we making jokes about him? I want, no, like, ribbed for your, <laughs> your, her pleasure. Whose pleasure? <laughs> they're they're all dudes. The they're all dudes in, in Dreamland, dude. <laughs> no, one of the girls is on the TV show. I don't know. One of them. Nah, I don't even know. They're all dudes. Come on. The girls the are game. dudes? You played the game. Yeah. It's like Kirby's a dude. Meta Knight's a dude. DDD's a dude. They're all dudes. That's true. Okay. It's a game oh, for dudes. Ribbed for his pleasure. Yeah. You know DDD? It's actually DD Dude. <laughs> do do dude, dude, dude. <laughs> dude, dude, dude. <laughs> they were gonna call him do do dude, but that was just too much. <laughs> yeah, the do do part kind of threw it off. Yeah, uh, we can't call him do do. <laughs> People will think it's like poo poo. Poo poo pee 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 pee. Might as well call him King Poo Poo Pee Pee at that point. <laughs> <laughs> that was in the uh, blueprint, Kirby's Pee Land. Yeah, <laughs> that's why Miyamoto wanted him to be yellow. Remember, because Miyamoto yeah. was like he, he should be yellow. It's because he was he's gonna be a pee pee. That's <laughs> when Sakurai pee-pee. stepped in and said, "No, he'll be the color of flesh." <laughs> Sakurai had like diarrhea that day. He just, he's has like some Pepto Bismol. He just looks at the bottle and he's like, "Oh." <laughs> <laughs> The team's like, what color is Kirby? And then Sakurai walks over with a bottle of Pepto Bismol and just splats it on the board. And Mm -hmm. and 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 everyone's like, Oh (laughs) it's perfect. Black and white. Or baby puke green. Guys, we better, we better uh, do this one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, probably makes sense. Welcome. Hello, everybody. Hi, <laughs> welcome to Hi. the show. Hi, <laughs> uh, welcome, one and all, to the end of uh, uh, All Map August Rush Edition. Uh, this episode is special. You know, we had some other map outs this month. One chosen by me, and then one chosen by Spencer, and then one chosen by Teddy. This one has been chosen by you, the viewer. Uh, so congratulations. Right, the uh, choices. They had three of our... We each got to pick a game, which they voted on. And whose pick is this yeah. one? <laughs> <laughs> it's Kirby. Who, who, My... who doesn't love Kirby, though? They Some picked people. wrong. <laughs> The viewers, no, of, this, right. the viewers picked... of this channel are fools. They're absolute no. fools, and this Absolutely is proof no. of why they are Look, fools. Is they picked they they they're into it. Spencer, I will five. take... Look, okay, I my I had Metroid Fusion. This game, I, I think, is a suitable choice above Metroid Fusion, but if you try to tell me Aladdin is a choice, is a suitable choice what above Metroid Fusion. What better choice than out. Aladdin? Get you have... out! More, the yeah, Metroid we're big, Fusion? We're big in the, <laughs> we really got a big Disney audience, you know? We've really attracted the Disney crowd over the years. But I can really of, see why they would pick Aladdin. Think about, <laughs> no, 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 but you're guys, you guys, you're thinking short-sighted. Yeah. You're thinking about, okay. like, the games that you might like to play. But think okay. about the map out, the cool things right. we could talk about if we picked Aladdin. Yeah. All the, the genie, yeah. you got a, yes. 
a carpet, a rug, a, car- yeah, a carpet, a not a rug. Come uh, on, I love lamp. Yeah, Abu, Abu the monkey. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, Gilbert Gottfried. We could do some Gilbert Gottfried mm-hmm. impressions. That's gone now. That's out of the picture. You know what? I'm never going to recommend that game again. So everybody that wanted that game to happen, sorry, it's done. Yeah, the two people. <laughs> It was 30 votes and it was 11%. I think that's the data. That's in the data. 30 vote. 33 votes, maybe. Yeah. You could just try yeah, to the, overthrow the, the election, yeah. Spencer. I want yeah. a recount, to be honest. I think I think we sure. need to have a recount. <laughs> yeah. Well, based on the current data, Kirby, you are the winner. So congratulations. The big Yay. sucker himself. Yay. <laughs> yeah. And Daddy, I did. Why, I did this why, one. I picked Kirby's Dreamland too. Yeah. Why did I pick Kirby's Dreamland too? Yeah, I, yeah I was asking why. Yeah, I'll, you know it. I was going to ask you why'd you pick Kirby's Dreamland too? Sure. Uh because I knew it would win. Oh, uh, he just wanted to win. <laughs> now Teddy's Teddy's playing with stats now. <sighs> yeah, oh, I'm playing show, the game. The show be damned. <laughs> In the just, game, suckers. Just wanted the W. <laughs> the biggest sucker of them all, Kirby. <laughs> How many suck jokes can I make today? This game sucks. At least three. (laughs) If you like hearing hearing suck jokes, make sure that you hit like, comment, and subscribe. uh, And ring the bell so you can hear all the suck jokes that we come up with every week. Suck all over them. Yeah, and we previously did a Kirby month. And guess what? If you're on Apple Podcasts or Spotify, you can go listen to all of those Kirby episodes. They're on there. That's true. Yeah. You could. You could. You know, this Good. is the third Kirby map out we've done. We've done Dreamland, Superstar, and now today, Dreamland. No, fourth, fourth, two. fourth. We did forgot the other one. Forgotten oh, World. Yeah, I forgot. Forgotten Land. Forgotten yeah. Land. What's it called? I forgot the title. Kirby Forgotten Land. I, I almost said Forgotten World. I can't remember. Kirby Forgotten <laughs> Land. So this is I take it back. Fourth Kirby map out. We're, we're a you, couple Kirby guys. How could you forget that one? It was like three hours long. <laughs> yeah, and we and, and 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 we spent an hour and a half talking. <laughs> <laughs> I know Brian told me the whole story. It just went in one ear and not the other. Just, I don't know what happens. I love you, Brian. <laughs> you gotta tell me the story again of Kirby and how he forgot his land. <laughs> yeah, so you fight you fight Krakow on the stage. Yeah, Krakow. I remember when I first saw Krakow. <laughs> I remember he was a big cloud. <laughs> he came in with his eyeball. <laughs> it was really interesting. He dropped Waddle Dees, and I really love the Waddle Dees. The Waddle Dees, I remember them from when I was a teenager in high school. Back in the war. <laughs> I remember. Cracko was dropping Waddle Dees on the. <laughs> Back in the war. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god could you imagine being at war like being in the trenches and then all of a sudden over the like the hillside just Krako yeah. comes flying from the opposition's <laughs> side of the battlefield <laughs> i would just give up i'd just be like okay well <laughs> we'll just dropping like flies getting hit by lightning bolts <laughs> classic Spencer you got a good war story for oh him. okay yeah Spencer give us a war story uh, no, I don't really have any good ones. They, they all come from video games or Saving Private Ryan. I'll take it. Call of Duty something is. Oh, you know, what? I saw um, six is coming out. I saw one recently. It had Shia LaBeouf in it. It was called Rage, okay. I think, or something. That one was pretty good. How far in the Shia timeline is that? Yeah, is it after mental break? Oh, I don't know. I, I I don't I don't I didn't remember. I mean, he's kind of old in it, so it's probably after he went a little crazy. But he's awesome. Shia LaBeouf is a good actor. I've I've got oh, no, respect we, for him. We love Shia LaBeouf around here. Yeah. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> yeah. Make your dreams come true. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well. Today's special guest, Shia Le Kirby. Welcome to Dreamland 2, everybody. Um, yes. We should probably get into this is it. a map out. Uh, what is yeah, a map this out? Is the map out? What's a map out? It's a map, and we take it out, and we look at the map, and we observe it, 
and then we eat it. It's like Kirby would. Wad it up, put it in our mouth, chew it up. It's, it's paper. It won't hurt us. Little did you know, I yeah. I wrote I I wrote on that piece of paper poison. Now you're poisoned. What are you gonna do? <laughs> Inhale an, up an antidote. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> It's like a choose your own adventure. In. It's yeah. like a choose your own adventure episode of the podcast. Wouldn't that be awesome? <laughs> what will you do? <laughs> if you chose take antidote, skip to twenty three forty five. If you chose die, pause the video. <laughs> <laughs> we should make a video like a choose your own adventure podcast. You've chosen. You've chosen take antidote. <laughs> <laughs> Good choice. <laughs> we should have done that with this and did three different map outs. And so, like, if you chose um, Aladdin, go to hour two. And if you chose any of the other ones, kill yourself. What do you do for two hours before? You, yeah, no, you, you, you skip it. You skip it, and you you just start watching the Aladdin one. So what's between yeah, well, yeah, the what's, ten minute fifty eight mark where we're at now and the two hour mark where only you are talking about Aladdin? The well, the other, we'll do the we'll still do the other two game talks, but no one will ever see them. They'll be instructed not. To. They died. Yeah, they, you told them to. Mm-hmm. <laughs> they followed the instructions. Well, but we're dead. But we we chose those games. <laughs> Technically, we're dead. Pick the mapper you trust the most, and uh, if you if it's Spencer, tell me why. Tell me why. Tell me why I play How much Aladdin you guys... or I die. <laughs> How about you guys tell me your history with Kirby's Dreamland too? Mm. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> this is a good. Do this it. is a Spencer segment. Spencer special. <laughs> Spencer, what do you got? I have, I have no history with this game. Come on. <laughs> Come on, Spencer. I got nothing. <laughs> Make I'm, it interesting, dude. Make it. I've got. I've got fucking nothing. I played game a couple Game Boy games, and this was not one of them. I. I, don't, I have nothing from this game. All right. Whatever. <laughs> Did you want to play it? Did you? Were you aware of it? I was always kind of aware of Kirby because he was. He's like in the even back then. He was kind of in the lexicon, but like, no, I never. I never really stumbled upon it. I never like yearned for it i didn't even know what kirby was really the first my first kirby and i think we already talked about it was like the kirby golf game on the super nintendo dream course right? so i just yeah Jump. dream course so i just figured he was just like a golfer or something i don't know <laughs> hmm. all right well yeah i i also have no history with this fucking game uh i didn't play it till like that dream collection came out on the wii um it was on there, and then I played it on 3DS, and that's how I played it today. So, uh, unlike Dreamland One, which I did grow up with, I did not grow up with this game. Here we are. Yeah, we are. Here we are. We are here. I did play it. <laughs> when? When did you play it? When? Speak when. when. Nah. Yes, yes. When I was a child, <laughs> I I just remember Ricky the hamster and oh, yeah. the fish was weird and the owl was cool. And that's about it. Dude, I knew those characters from Star Stacker before I played this game. So when I played Star finally Stacker? Played this game, I was like, yo, yes, yes. Uh, Star Stacker is a Game Boy puzzle game. Mm-hmm. It's like a okay. Kirby puzzle game. They're like, they're, they're in that game. So I played this game finally i was like yo it's the dude from star stacker <laughs> i had that game as a kid <laughs> alex what is the kirby timeline up to kirby streamline 2 Ooh, that is a good question uh let me totally not uh make sure i'm r- wrong or not wrong um so previously before dreamlands 2 we only had two games uh, before this we did kirby's dreamland imagine that could you imagine that? I'm trying to imagine it. <laughs> there it is. Uh, we had Kirby's Dream Land 1 on the Game Boy. We also had Kirby's Adventure on the NES. That came out. Uh, a, a Dream Land 1 was 92 and Adventure was 93. And then this is 95. So in terms of the main games, that's the timeline. Um, and then it looks like 
Pinball Land came out in 93, and Spencer Dream Course came out the same year as Dream Land 2. Um, so that's roughly... Actually, yeah, it came out before Dream Land 2. So that's that, that's roughly the Kirby timeline up to this point. Yeah, but I about remember those? we had picked Kirby's Adventure to map out at one point, and I think we all played it, and we're like, how do we map this out? Yeah. Yeah, I like that game. I actually played that game when I was a kid, too. I like Adventure, but I feel like we're going to have much mm. of the same issue today <laughs> as we would have with that one as well. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to do things a little differently. We're going to go into a little bit more of the history before we get into the game, and we'll talk as much of the game as we can. Yeah. You could have had Aladdin, people. V viewers watching at home, you could have had Aladdin. Spencer, Spencer, name me one Aladdin song. One Aladdin song? Oh my god. Um, a whole new world? I can't, think, I can't think of any of them. A whole new world? I, just I can gave show you, you a way. I can uh, show you the way? That's, oh, that's us on it. Uh, I can show you the way. For that's some reason, world. when I try to think of, of songs from Aladdin, I only think of songs from Little Mermaid. What about Prince the Ali, Ali Abi, Ali Ababa. A friend, fr friend like me. That's the G. That's Robin you Williams. You got a friend in me. No, no, that's that's Toy you Story. Got, <laughs> you got a friend in me. You ain't never heard a friend. Never heard a friend. Never. That, that song. Come on, Robin Williams. Yeah. You got a friend in me. <laughs> yeah, Street Rat. I love Rand I love Randy Newman. I get out of here. I don't buy that. Oh, come on. There's there's the that game that that movie has so much great music. And I'm sure the game does okay. too, but we'll never know. We'll never. You know. want to map out the movie? Well, we're gonna do a new channel, the Button Moviers. <laughs> the movie mappers. Well, it was the the movie, the game, the game sure. based on the movie. We could have sung the song. And the chip tune soundtracks were real much better, really better. Oh, I bet you. Oh my God, I bet you they were so good. Yeah. I'm just trying to picture okay. them now, but we'll never know. It's okay, hidden gem month. That's on you, Spencer. That'll be your pick. It's gonna keep hiding. It's going in the Disney vault. Sorry, yeah. it's going in the Spencer Vault. Everybody's <laughs> lost it. I apologize. It's not. It it's, wasn't my it's, choice. It's eking back out. It's 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 mm -hmm. ruminating in this episode. This was I'm a choice that the, the viewers would made. It, would, it, would it be hilarious if my next month I just choose Aladdin? You can't. I, <laughs> no, well, I can't. I'm putting. I can't. Like, I can do whatever I want. I'm drawing, I can do whatever I want. drawing the line in the sand. You cannot <laughs> pick Aladdin. Aladdin month. It's it's. Why does it have to be month. sand, man? <laughs> Because it's Aladdin. It's Hagrabah. The yeah. desert. Yeah. It's okay. We'll pick desert month. Ooh. You know? There we go. Yeah. Or what's the, what's the, what are those stories? Like the thing it's from like that and like, what, like uh, Sinbad and other stories. Like what's that? What is that from? Something. Ah, uh, whatever. I don't care that much. Kind of like thinking it's from the Disney. Uh, oh, um, um, Arabian Nights. It's like Arabian Nights uh, month. You know, we'll just we play just Prince do... of Persia then. That's what you can Arab yeah. month. <laughs> Arab month. Okay, that's a little crazy. It's going to go real well. No, it's, it's a appreciation, you know? Just... Arab appreciation month. Boy, do I appreciate these Arabs. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Arab game number one. Yeah. <laughs> Curatory on his last game. Anyways. Speaking of appreciation. I don't know what that's called. Spencer, we should appreciate Dreamland 2 and stop trying to appreciate Aladdin. Yeah, that's a good point. I'm going to try my best to appreciate this, even though everybody it's everybody made a huge Fine. mistake. And, and sure. today... Look, not off to your great I lost, yeah. I, lost, <laughs> I lost Metroid Zero Mission. I said Fusion earlier. I, I lost Metroid Zero Mission. Okay? It hurts, too. I know. And I was closer than you. But here we are with Dreamland 2. Dreamland Spencer, do you want to pretend death. that you picked Kirby's Dreamland 2? It's not an ego thing. I don't have an ego. I I didn't have to win. That was Kirby. It. Okay, so Spencer actually sent Teddy a message and said, "Can you choose Dreamland Two for me? Because I, I I can't pick between Dreamland Two and Aladdin." Don't listen to Alex. So. He's a damn fool. We have the receipts. Yeah, Spencer, you're the you're the Kirby guy. <laughs> You know what's sad? I had to turn my video off. I'm actually wearing a Kirby shirt today, and I can't even be on camera. I'm sad now. 
Oh, wow. I have a Kirby shirt. Oh, you shirt. wear it so Kirby doesn't have to wear a shirt. Well, shit, as I we a, all do. I have a Kirby shirt, don't I? Huh. Forgot. Ironically, Kirby is the best shirt you can get know, at GameStop. Got, they don't have you, better I shirts. I got than you that. that Kirby shirt. Yeah, yeah, I've got it. Oh, my God, I forgot. Uh-oh. Oh, here we go. Look at him. He's a beautiful boy. It's a bunch of Kirbys. Let's see. Yeah. I have um. Black oh, Kirby. Teddy, you, you have invisible Kirby. I know yeah. that ability. Disappear. You can see his uh his nipples, you know. I wish Kirby would go invisible on this on this game talk or get on this map out episode. Whoa, and then the never Kirby show up again. Hate is... <laughs> Stop calling it a game talk. <laughs> Disappear into Agrabah, where he where we should be. Well, he's very much not disappearing. In fact, he's going to appear today in this map out of Kirby's Dreamland too. It's true. Spencer, you're the lore master. Do you want to drop some sick lore? Did you mind to lore? Um, I would have to look that up. Oh, maybe it's in the maybe it's in the thing. I put it in the, the, the Kirby. yeah the Kirby fandom chat. Uh, well, geez, you know I have a the whole setup going on. I can't just like flip on a switch here. Oh my god! Um, just flip the switch. Just run it. Hold on, hold on. I think I can get to it. Run this show, Kirby's Dreamland Two. He's trying, to, he's, trying to sabotage, he's trying to sabotage the episode. All right, I got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> he's the guy. Wait. For those of you who want the best for the Kirby's Dreamland Two map out, here's your guy. All right, I already got it. Kirby We're lives. Counting on you. We're counting on you. Anyways, I'm sorry. Start again. One day in Agrabah, there was a guy called Aladdin. No, oh, okay. my. God. <laughs> I think that's how the story goes. Kirby lives in the Rainbow Islands of Dreamland. The rainbows yeah, that man. connect the islands have been stolen by the evil Dark Matter. It's got an that's exclamation fuck. mark. Uh, dark, so dark. dark Matter has taken control of King DDD and wants to turn Dreamland into a dark world. The with dark the, world. Walmart. With the help of... <laughs> <laughs> the back of a Walmart. You've been there. What a great dream. This is a nightmare. <laughs> Get me out of here. <laughs> Kirby and the great discounts. With the help of three friends, Kirby sets out on his latest quest to save Dreamland. Mm. Da, 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 da. Da, da, Kirby da, da, quest. Da, da, da. I'm pretty sure it's... Uh, not that. <laughs> I don't. I don't think. They, I don't think it's Kirby. <laughs> I don't think it's Kirby, guys. Okay, so that's the Kirby lore. Yeah, Kirby's trying to stop DDD Dark Matter. This is the beginning of the Dark Matter saga or trilogy, or whatever the hell they call it. Oh yes. Okay. Um, <laughs> Spencer knows <laughs> all about the Dark Matter. So trilogy. good. <laughs> It's uh, it's this game, Dreamland three and sixty four all make up the Dark Matter trilogy. Somehow they all connect to Dark Souls, which is why Spencer had a reaction here. Yeah, that'd be cool. No, this this precursors Dark Souls, Dark Matter. Isn't that right, Spencer? Yeah. Keep going. Yeah. Yeah. Move it along. So. So yeah, yeah. There's the people that actually don't. Uh, some people may not realize it, but yeah, there's like actually like a little bit of a, a story arc between those three games, um, and it all starts here. Yeah, Dreamland. the Cur the Kirby lore. Get out of here, Smith! <laughs> it's there. I think people <laughs> are really there. dialed in. <laughs> well, okay. So the Kirby lore, <laughs> Kirby lore may not be all that, but we can we can do some Kirby facts. Can you go a little higher in the wiki, and we'll go from where it's bolded, Kirby Streamline too. Where is it? Under Ricky. Ricardo. In the... Uh, um, you're talking about Rick the Hamster? Ricky. Yeah. Want me to read that part? So let's start from Kirby Streamline 2. It's a platformer developed by HAL Laboratory. <laughs> Kirby's Dreamland 2 is a platformer... Oh, the very, very top. It's a platformer Kirby game developed by HAL Laboratory and published by Nintendo for the Game Boy. It was released in Japan on March 21st, 1995, 
in North America on May 1st, 1995, in Europe on July 31st, 1995, and other places that we don't care about. The third main installment in the Kirby series and second of the Dreamland saga, it continues the adventures of Kirby from Kirby's Dreamland and Kirby's Adventure, adding three animal friends to aid Kirby in battle against Dark Matter and his forces. Thanks. <laughs> I read the thing. <laughs> 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 Thank you. <laughs> uh, it's well read. Thank you for reading it. I really, I really appreciate that. Is that is that what you want me to read? No. What, what did you want me to read? I thought we were on the strategy wiki, but I guess you were doing the. Oh, well, no, that's that's the, the, the confusion. Is oh, Alex sent me panel. sent me a wiki to read from, and now we got this other yeah. wiki here. <laughs> Which one you want like grassland as the first level or which which part do you want? No, I don't want that. <laughs> I um, want here, I'll tell you what, I'll copy paste the thing into the chat. Okay. And you can read that. <laughs> oh my goodness. What is this episode? It's really good. This is what the viewers wanted, right? That's what they asked for. This is basically what I read. What we just this is what he just no. read. No. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, let's start to read this and then it says different things. The first sentence is identical, yes. It is a sequel okay. to Kirby's Dreamland, but incorpor incorporates more elements from Kirby's Adventure oh. than from the former. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Although playable on the Game Boy, the game was released with the Super Game Boy adapter for the Super Nintendo Entertainment System in mind. Using the adapter to play it adds a custom Kirby themed border and remade level specific palettes and even portrays some sections of the game like menu screens and the ending in full color. It was re released via the Nintendo eShop for the Nintendo 3DS in 2012. So, with that in mind, when you guys played this game, what how did you play it and what was the overlay or what was the visual style? I played on the 3DS and it was monochrome. <laughs> uh, but you know, that, that is interesting uh, because little, fun fact about my life, I had the super uh, uh, thing, the super Game Boy adapter for the Super Nintendo for the longest time um, up until about 2016, I sold it for like $150. <laughs> mm. but, I, but as a kid, I bought that thing at like a yard sale and and had it. And I used to play it for like, you know, I played like Pokemon and uh, DK land and stuff like that. We whatever else on it. Um, so that's cool. Not, not every day I get to talk about the super game boy. I had one of those as well, um, and I played almost exclusively Pokemon on it. A little bit of Dragon Warrior, but I had no idea what was going on. Uh, and, you, you know, what's weird is I think one of our neighbors was, like, a nerd, and I had no idea until he, like, moved away and had, like, a yard sale. And he had a Super Scope. It was, like, a Super Ooh. Nintendo, like, shooting thing. Um, yeah. He had a multi-tab. And... Maybe that was it, but yeah, he had. So I had those as well, but I didn't have a game that could use the super scope because he, I don't know, I lost it or he didn't have it. I can't remember. And then so uh, he just used it in Pokemon battles. So yeah, just like it Pokemon. attacked my brother <laughs> with it, hit him in the head. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, it was it was cool. I got a lot of weird shit from that. So, but yeah, Super Game Boy was legit because now you didn't need batteries. Yeah, <clears throat> that and also uh you're playing in color i mean the first game boys like the original game boy was the gross green screen and then the game boy pocket was black and white and it wasn't until the game boy color came out which actually i don't know the year for that maybe someone could fact check me on it but uh it wasn't until that came out that you were able to see any elements of color in original game boy games so the fact that it released with the super nintendo game boy adapter and allowed you to see color in Game Boy games, there's almost something Dorothy esque about it. Yeah. Apparently, Game like Boy 98? Color came out in October of 1998. Now makes, I was right, feel, 98. It makes me feel old because I thought <laughs> yeah. it came out came out like way earlier than that. But jeez, mm -hmm. it's pretty yeah, cool. I felt like I played Pokemon when I was two. I guess I was wrong. <laughs> uh, it was like it was like alongside like Gen two, like around that time that they were really mm -hmm. pushing it. So, um, yeah, 
Uh, but you know, the Super Game Boy was cool, uh, and I wish I had played this in color. Uh, but I played it in monochrome. Spencer, you played it in color. I Did I? That. Your you, text message would indicate that it had your, color. <laughs> yeah, when you sent us your completion thing, it was in color. Was it? Mine wasn't. Let me see. Spent... Oh, I guess God. it. I guess it was. That's weird. Because yeah, I was just playing. Oh, I guess I was playing. Maybe I was playing it on a Game Boy Color emulator, or something. That. Mm. Oh, that would make sense. That would make sense. Yeah, with most of the emulators, you can choose the Game Boy visual display. I learned that with Link's Awakening when I played that recently. And even with the Switch emulator, you can choose whether to output in green, black and white, or upscale to color on the settings. I want virt Virtual Boy red and black. <laughs> Gonna do it. Um, on some emulators, maybe? The headache inducer. <laughs> okay, yeah. Ah! The 3D glasses when you go Kirby, see Spy Kids at the movie. Kirby's thing. right in my face. <laughs> what was your guy's first Game Boy? Pocket. Oh, the fat, the, uh, yeah, the fatty. I had the fat boy. The brick? Yeah, the gray brick. That was my first Game Boy. Um, but it, it was shortly after that that I got the. Actually, you know what? I, I might have got it mixed up. I might have gotten a green Game Boy Color first and then gotten a brick like handed to me down the road. I just had it. But for some reason, I mm -hmm. think I had the brick first, but that, I may be wrong. <laughs> that was three oh, I, batteries, right? Three double A's? The brick, it's more. The brick, I think, is four. I think the pocket was three or something. The pocket, I had a pocket for a little That's bit. Right. The brick had four, though. The brick ate up, dude. And don't even get me started on a Game Gear because I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm gonna pull it off my shelf and show you. I'm gonna. I have two of them over there. Spitzer, I look at them. It's weird because I got uh, the the Game Boy Pocket first because it was cheaper. It was the cheapest thing that we could get, and then and fit your pocket. Event eventually got a Super Game Boy and then just completely moved to that. And then by the time I actually played Pokemon Gold, I was using the brick because somebody had given me that. And I had like a little <laughs> AC adapter for it. So Ooh. it was just like, it was like I went backwards to play Pokemon Gold for some reason. Do Game Boy Colors games work on, a, on the brick? The ones that aren't transparent. So the ones in black cases or like other cases will work, but the one the the color games that are in the transparent cases will not. So okay. basically, when the when like Pokemon Gen two or like any of the ones in like the black uh, cases are are put into a regular Game Boy, they just work as regular Game Boy games. That's cool. Yeah. What are games that have the transparent casing? Um, I, look, I've only had a few. Oh, uh, Mario Bros. Deluxe is, is one that I know. Uh, the other ones are embarrassing because I had them as a kid. Cubert <laughs> and Emperor's <laughs> New Groove. Hell yeah. Uh, uh, it's like any of the ones. Uh, yeah, any, any of the ones with uh, <laughs> with the fat, like the fat, weird, transparent cases. I'm trying to like think the, maybe Super Mario Bros. Deluxe and that, yeah, Oracle I said that Ages, one. maybe? Uh, yeah, I think you're right. I I think both the Oracle games were were those were the color exclusive. Yeah. Speaking of which, my first Game Boy was the Game Boy Color, the Atomic Purple model, which had the you could actually see into the system, kind of like how the modern Ooh. computers are built. You can see the innards. Yeah. You can see my Game Boy Color digesting battery power. <laughs> I just had the plain green one, but I do love that color, man. I'm that that was my first GBA. Was that like the fat one with the it's like the like the see through indigo? Mm -hmm. I love that style. I'm pretty nostalgic. Cause my first N sixty four controller was like that too, like the see through yeah. purple. Yeah. Cool. Now I can see through my hand. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Uh, is there anything else about Kirby's history, lore, etc., that you would like to tackle? Suck? 
<laughs> so, uh, where, where does it fit in the in the Kirby timeline? On the timeline, where does it fit in the Zelda timeline? Yeah, where, where does Kirby's Dream yeah. fit in the Zelda timeline? <laughs> is this is this in the Zelda timeline? Yeah. Well, in Link's so, Awakening, Kirby is there. He's in the Eagle Tower. Yeah. Watch out. You're welcome. Yeah. You, you could say that Link's in a dream land. Yeah, it's you true. Could. He is awakening. You you could say that. I wouldn't say that, but you could say that. What would you say? Something about Aladdin? Okay, next. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, okay, I'll, I'm gonna read. I'm gonna read this from the uh, trivia section here on Dreamland Two uh, fan wiki. Uh, trivia says this is the, this is the first entry in the Dark Matter trilogy, which would follow up by Dreamland Three <laughs> and Kirby <Jesus>. Sixty Four. <laughs> yes, <laughs> you did it. I did it. Um. I don't know. There's some other cool stuff in here. This is the only mainline Kirby game not to have the invincibility candy. I guess that's true. I didn't. I didn't get one. You know, I, I was think thinking about that. It. I was thinking about that when I was playing. I so said, "Where's the invincibility candy in this game?" <laughs> it really yeah, is a lollipop to action. Yeah. He would. Spencer wouldn't stop texting me, and I was like, "Dude, leave me alone." It's like three in the morning. Yeah. Where's the get good at Kirby, here? man? You play Dark Souls. You can do it. Yeah, well, it's it's a different kind of challenge, I think. Um, issue seventy two, uh, uh sh- issue seventy two of Nintendo Power, um, states that Kirby's Dream Land two offers the player limited continues. In reality, the game offers unlimited continues. Wow. I never found so out. I had like twenty five really lives the ball on that one. <laughs> at the time I died. So. I, I hope someone at 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 Nintendo Power got fired yeah. for that one. Yeah, me too. <laughs> yeah, me three. I hope they got hired at Game Pro. Game Informer. I mean, are we ready to talk about this game? I mean, there's a it's a whole new world. Oops. Yeah, let's go. Let's yeah, go. Let's <laughs> let's go to the manual, and it's it's not quite a whole new world. It's it's actually similar. It's a similar world. A whole similar to, uh, world. Kirby's Adventure. What makes Kirby's Dreamland 2 similar to Kirby's Adventure is the fact that it copies the copy ability. Guys, tell me about Kirby's copy ability. What is it? It sucks. And the enemies. <laughs> You're <laughs> right. Take their powers. <laughs> you do. Yeah. I think I think my soul just left my body for a second there, Alex. <laughs> Why? Your Kirby sucks joke. Because it was too good. <laughs> it's too good. Thank we you. need a counter, <laughs> Spencer. Too... Fun yeah. editing. All right, so there are a total of seven copy abilities that I'm counting here. They are. Anybody want to read them? I'm not looking at the thing you're looking at, Spencer. One second. I'm adding a Kirby sucks counter. He's getting the sucks counter up. <laughs> what is it at? Like three. How many? Is it? Is that three? I, don't, I mean, I'm just starting it now. But possibly you want to say three? Possibly. I think it possibly. I think it might be four, but let's just say three. Let's just all agree. Say I, three. I feel like I had three at the start of the episode. Ooh. Ooh. I want to say a solid seven. No, that's no, 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 no. Five. Cut the difference. Seven You've only made nine. two? I've made two. I think. I might have made three. I don't know. Let, let's say five. Okay, okay five. Five okay. is the starting point. What's the goal? We have like 30 minutes. Let's <laughs> say like 25. Is that a good goal? That goal sucks. <laughs> or is it six that kind of counts because it's like almost a pun 6.5 or sucks 0.5 oh that's seven right there all right so the uh when fighting enemies your special powers are the parasol burning needle spark ice 
stone and cutter. Cutter. Yep. Thank Classic. you, Spencer. Uh, let's talk about them. What what are uh, what's up with these abilities? What do they do? I don't know. You barely need any of them ever. So I almost never sucked anything oh, up. Come on, Spencer. I think I use the parasol the most. Um and the needle. I think I use those two. Because the parasol you could like fly easier and I think you could break things mm. um more conveniently that were like to the side. So I remember using that. And the needle was just almost like a get out of free jail free card of not getting hit by people. So I'm all for the burning. I like the fireball. My top ones are actually ice and cutter. I think they're the most useful. Maybe they make you the most kind of invulnerable and they give you that good uh, proximity attack. I do like parasol just from a cuteness standpoint, just to have Kirby floating down stages. And when combined with the owl, it's pretty useful. And even Ricky, I think Ricky kind of puts Kirby up on top of the parasol, bouncing as a little ball. That's adorable. Burning, I like as standalone Kirby, uh, just be, just for the the dashing attack. And then I don't really like burning with any of the creatures that I can think of. Uh, needle is okay, I guess. Uh, spark is cool. It's kind of a classic. Um, but yeah, ice and cutter are just my favorites. Nice. <laughs> Well, they, nice. these these are all nice. These are all classic Kirby abilities, though. Future Kirby games moving forward, you're guaranteed to see probably all of these in some form. Um, mm -hmm. I, I don't remember which. I don't remember how many of these are from Adventure. Some got cut. I know uh, Wheel was in Adventure, and that's not here. Uh, and I'm mm. I, don't, I don't know which which other ones might have gotten cut. Maybe Bomb. I'm not sure, but. Mm -hmm. You see Poppy. Yeah, Poppy you do see Poppy. Poppy Bros. Jr., our boy. Poppy Bros. Jr. Big fan. And I feel like the show. um the like the laser whip. Oh yeah, that was an adventure, wasn't it? I think so. Yeah. Spencer? Okay. Yeah. I know what Spencer's saying though, because when you go into those like mini boss regions or even to the bosses, these special attacks do less damage than inhaling their little star projectiles and firing them back at them. Yeah, it's true. But but you have to like sometimes you have to wait for certain animations to play out with the bosses and it's easier just to throw my cutter at them fifteen times <laughs> than to true. wait for them to give me a star. <laughs> So if you had to go into an arena with a boss, which Kirby special power are you picking and why? Probably Cutter. I would think. I need to list one more time. Parasol. Paras oh, go ahead. Okay. Not that Parasol. one. Parasol. Did you imagine entering a fight with, with just an umbrella? <laughs> Peach. Hey, best, don't underestimate it. characters ever. I keep an umbrella in my car at all times. Well, I'm, I penguin. I think that's for rain. I think that's for rain. Penguin. I don't think it's for fighting. True. <laughs> for yeah, fighting Batman. Rain. Penguin. Peach. Both use umbrellas. Kirby. He mm -hmm. uses an umbrella. A parasol. Anybody else? Same thing. Anybody else? Parasol. Uh, he's paragliding. Uh, Rihanna yeah. under my umbrella. Ella. Ella. I'm gonna stab you with my umbrella, Ella. Uh, my umbrella, Ella. A. Hey. That's her. That's her pressing the A button, mashing it, to make meaning she's <laughs> stabbing you with it. Okay, umbrella. Um, what else? What's her name? Madeline. Who? Madeline. You know the, the girl she movie. Umbrella? She's like the in the rain jacket or something. There's a YouTube hey. video that says top ten Four characters line. that fight with umbrellas or pairs. <laughs> of course, number <laughs> ten. Is it Watch Mojo? No. Damn it. <laughs> oh, it's Mr. Top here. Mr. <laughs> Mr. Top Ten List. Yo, I know that. Yo. Guy. Mr. Top Ten, the one and only. Look, or the I only ten call, and only. I only call one man Mr. and it's Beast. Okay. Okay. Mr. I, to, I, I just call him Beast. Anyway. Um, okay, Parasol's a no. <laughs> 
burning. Mm, that seems painful. No. Like for me, because I'd light myself on fire. Needle. Mm, how big are the needles? Like a sewing needle? Hmm. No. Like, like a porcupine? Needle. Yeah. No, like no, I'm not going to fight with that. That that that's like a defensive. That's like curl up in a ball. You know, I'm not. No, I'm wanting to fight. So no. Okay. Yeah, I know that triggered Spencer. Spark. Sp Ooh, spark might be good. That a little, a little electrocution, a little taser, maybe. Hmm. Yeah, he is flexing. In the photo. Ice. Nah. Just like throw some ice cubes at him. Yeah, and you also hit him with the ice beam. Yeah, but I'm trying to think of like like the realistic version of that. I don't have an ice beam. Okay. okay ice breath. Yeah, I just put a mitt in my mouth and breathe on him. Yeah. Stone. That one's just rocks. You're just throwing rocks. Yeah, it doesn't really work as good as in Smash Brothers. Yeah. Cutter. That's probably the move right there. Cutter's probably the one you want to fight. That seems like the most I, realistic. You're both cutters. Not in that way. Don't call me that. that might <laughs> hey guys, we're, we're actually doing Mental Health Awareness Month. We've been... Uh... <laughs> A little insensitive lately. <laughs> it's quite the accusation <laughs> on this podcast. <laughs> it's, it's just me doing it. Look, just because, because I listen, fine. just because I listened to the 2001 album of uh, Lincoln Park Hybrid Theory, doesn't mean anything's going on. Okay, <laughs> I listen to it every day. Yeah, I just pick cutter ability every time I see it in Kirby. You know, nothing different, nothing weird about that. <laughs> Crawling in my skin. <laughs> <laughs> um, Defend it. Yeah, I'd probably go cutter though. Why? Because it cuts. Yeah, because it's pretty good for a fight. Okay. Well, I think it sucks. Add that to the counter. Eight. Uh, I'm doing ice. Why? How? And what? When? What uh, scenario? Utility. Water boss. But I don't have a water boss. This is real life, Daddy. Well, everybody drinks water. That's true. Water That's is the primary component in the human body. So, are are you telling me that I'm made up primarily ice? <laughs> uh, you will be if you get stuck in an arena with Ice Kirby. Just saying. I'd rather be stuck in an arena with and Ice Spencer, Kirby. Spencer, your rationale. I mean, you gotta yeah, have a projectile. Picking? Everyone wants a projectile in a fight. What are you? What are you picking? I already said cutter. I said that forever ago. Uh, oh, you went with me. Copy me. I see. Well, well, I went first, so I don't see how I Nothing's could copy. Changed. Nothing's changed. Go always copy me. <laughs> well, and we're all copying each other because it's a copy ability. So That's true. Don't be offended. Yeah. But hey, you could throw a you could throw a parasol. Which came first, the Kirby or the copy ability? Don't answer that. <laughs> the Kirby or the fax machine? <laughs> <laughs> don't answer that. <laughs> we think deeply about this. Okay, moving on. Let's map it out. <laughs> okay. Okay. Spencer, you're in charge. Uh, well, I I figure a more <laughs> beneficial thing would be to talk about the three friends, right? Yes. Oh, finally. Oh, that's us, the three amigos. Oh, Trace. Amigos. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, I, you want to talk about our friendship? Can I be the fish? Yeah, you can be the fish. Um, but first, yeah. we got to talk about Rick. Rick the hamster. Carries Kirby on Ricky his shoulders. Boy. And and Rick, Ricardo. Rick doesn't slip on ice. He doesn't fuck around with ice. I'm gonna need you to call him Ricardo. 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 Uh then Kine. Kine the fish is a great swimmer. Oh yeah, he is. 
With kind, Kirby can yeah. swallow while in water. What kind of fish is he? What kind of fish is he? Carp? Sorry, that joke sucked. <laughs> yeah, it's, Nine, it's the baby. only one of today. Uh, Koo. Koo the owl can help Kirby get to those hard to reach places because he can't get them on his Ooh. get there on his own. It's not like he can't like <laughs> fly himself. Uh, when he has what, what animal buddy would really help Kirby in his adventure? <laughs> the one that flies. When he has special powers, watch out! Watch out! It's the owl. Ooh! I thought the owl was kind of cool. He's the best one. Kind of cool. He was kind of cool. Guys. He's overthrowing the uh, the Dreamland government. It's a coup. <laughs> so you want to talk? Do the the actual map out, or? But I, you don't want to talk about the friends. What did we? I lit, We literally <laughs> just did. There's nothing more. You just said what they are. What do you think about them? <laughs> what do you I like th- Ricardo or what? <laughs> Ooh, I'm sorry, Ricardo. Ricardo? Uh, no, he sucks. Kine or Kine? Uh, Add to the counter. Oh, was that? Oh my god, that wasn't even intentional. Ten. We're at ten. Yeah. We're at ten. Oh, I missed ten. one. That's okay. At least, maybe more. I'll say ten. Okay. Um, I'm, I'm Koo a kind is fan. Why would you put a flying creature in a game where your main character can fly? Because look, because when you get the copy abilities, you can combine them with the animal bodies, and they have different outcomes, and it's cool. And sometimes you want to fly and have different outcomes, Spencer. Damn it. Not as cool as a fish, though. A fish is only cool underwater. A fish out of water. That was rough. Playing Kirby's Kine or on land. <laughs> that's that's how a pro gamer plays. Kine out of land. You know, Kine on land. Kine run. Yeah. Explain kine that only. to me. Yeah, kind only run. <laughs> <laughs> that kind of run. And, and you have to play with the DK bongos. <laughs> yeah. Blindfolded. While Blindfolded playing, while playing Dark feet. Souls with your other hand, your spare hand. Yeah, and someone's with, tickling with, your feet. While playing Dark Souls with the Guitar Hero controller. <laughs> yeah. Do the math. It's, it's, it's been done on stream, so figure it out. With your hands behind your back. <laughs> yeah, while playing <laughs> with both both hands banging on the bongos and playing the guitar with your hands behind your back. <laughs> Figure it out. Bongo and guitar, same time run. Pine only, blindfolded. Send us video evidence. We need it. Yeah. We'll analyze it here on stream, on video. I wish I had the game and a, and a Game Boy player. I, w- I would actually try a bongo run. I don't know how that would, how that would look, or if if it would even work. <laughs> Who'd you like? Fans. You want to talk about these animals? Who'd you like? What's your favorite animal? <laughs> What's your favorite animal? It's Koo. I love Koo. Screen? I already said Koo. I'm a big Koo guy. A real Koo guy, huh? You're some Koo guy. <laughs> Pretty cool. That's what they say about me. Pretty cool guy. I like to. I'm pretty fly. For a cool guy. <laughs> yeah. Like to imagine this is somebody's first map out, and they're like, "I thought they talked about like the game." <laughs> this is this is the game. <laughs> Guys, somebody's first map out. They said they should they should have done Aladdin. Uh, Who yeah. says that? Eleven percent of the smartest people in this group. And one of us probably you. you. <laughs> Can you, yeah, can you yeah, you better believe his it. Three accounts. We we made an agreement not to not to vote on this thing. Uh, I believe you didn't. But can you t- characterize the the map out fan who says, "I want Aladdin." Characterize them. Um, yeah. yeah, they're probably a doctor, maybe a lawyer. They're an intellectual for sure. They got it up here. Um, they have art. Artistic ability, but that's more of a hobby. They also have a very high-paying job, and 
Um, you know, they probably do a couple blue collar crimes, but that's okay because at the end of the day, they're going to pay their way through it and um, do really great things in their life. So that is the kind of person that would vote for Aladdin. I don't even want to talk about the kind of person that would vote for the other two. Oh, the bug map is pulling out of your poll. I'm going to vote for Aladdin. That's no, that's, that's not who would do it. That that voice. That's who did it. And you know that's what you did, did with it. that voice, by the way. No, that no, voice. That's would, no, that's the actual person that did it. That was the Kirby voice right there. That, no, that, that wasn't even me. That was the actual person to vote. No. That was the guy that oh, voted we had a for guest Kirby. Appearance. I guarantee you. And we did not have yeah. it. There's only... Was that Shia? Shia, get out of here. Shia, Shia buff. I vote for Aladdin. Baby wow. Shia. Okay. Shia LaBeouf is on my <laughs> side. And guess what? That's what I, I know you. I, 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 I like Aladdin. Shia's Shia on. LaBeouf. It's more like Shia LaSuck. Uh, I don't know. Put it on the counter. Put it on the counter. You're making me work for this counter. We should, we, guys. We should wait till like the last ten minutes of the episode, and then we should just run through all seven worlds. I mean, we're fifteen minutes away from that, so pick your poison. <laughs> <laughs> we're doing great, guys. Just stick with it. <laughs> just imagine we could be talking about Z- Metroid Zero Mission right now. Yeah, that could be. Oh no, Alex, Spencer you're becoming thing. Spencer. We're talking about that, I'm one. gonna start doing the Spencer thing now. <laughs> or guys, imagine we could actually have been talking about Kirby's Dreamland too this whole time, but you guys had to go and bring up your picks. The right pick, not picks. The right pick for you. Not Metroid for was the majority. Metroid was also the wrong Aladdin, pick, by the way. Dude, Aladdin's RFK Junior in this scenario. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a brain. <laughs> Worm. <laughs> RFK Sucking Jr. the life out of him. Dude, let's be real. There's no way that guy would have won an election with that voice. No. All politics no, aside, dude. that voice does not work <laughs> on the, the, the like State of the Union address. Other, oh my god. The other day he uh he announced he was he was dropping out and I was like, Were you even in? <laughs> You know he could have. I'm stepping away. <laughs> uh, I, I'm, I'm stepping away. I, I can't do, do the, the the election anymore because it's gonna be too hard. Because uh, I'm gonna pull votes away from Trump. Like, oh my god, what a like you you can't win with that. Just, it's just not gonna happen. And, and that was Aladdin in our in, in, in our poll. No, Aladdin was a was Celine Dion. With a beautiful <laughs> voice singing. Can you, be, can you sing A Whole New World as RFK Jr.? As <laughs> RFK Jr.'s A Whole New World. Uh, or uh, or you got a friend of me. Whole New World. <laughs> you got a friend of me. <laughs> so like that works, like actually. You could, RFK could yeah, that's, off. Yeah, I, I, actually, you know what? R, yeah, RFK is not too far off from Randy Newman already, so. That's actually yeah. not that. Randy Newman has like a really soft, like full body. Like, me. <laughs> yeah, voice kind of thing. I don't think you got uh, a friend. <laughs> you got a friend in me. <laughs> you got a friend in me. <laughs> what do you try to say about RFK's Randy Newman? Whoever let that man near a microphone. Pay him a million dollars. I'm sure they did get a lot of money for, for doing that. But Probably. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Randy Newman. Uh, yeah. Randy Newman. I did make a sock joke in there, so you can uh, add that to the camera. Oh, shit. That sucks. 13. Halfway there. Don't oh, add to that, Alex. Suck, suck count. I hope he labeled it suck counter. I didn't no, that wasn't a joke. I was just saying I hope he labeled it suck counter. Yeah. It's Kirby sucks okay. counter. <laughs> Is that the action? There's a counter and he's sucking it in. It sucks on the kitchen counter. <laughs> uh, you want to just call it suck I counter? Kirby! Here, no. Kirby! Get off the kitchen counter. <laughs> I'll call it the sucks counter. That is a good a probably better way to describe it. S U X. Kirby sucks counter. It's still it's still sucks like the counter. action. The, 
That's like the title of the video. You could make it that, yeah. You could just title this video, This Episode Sucks. Believe me. I'm about there. Can you, can you, when you make the thumbnail for this episode, can you put Aladdin in Kirby's mouth? Like Kirby's inhaling That's going to be his whole framing. He's going to be like, you could have picked Aladdin, <laughs> but you chose a... this. What, we, what the hell would we be talking about during Aladdin? Yeah, this is the carpet stage. This is the carpet stage. Uh, you remember the, the awesome like 3D-ish visuals in the movie? Uh, and they did all this, this cool the, stuff. You're escaping. Uh, you're escaping the 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 evil uh, like tiger face in the desert. That's the that's you you know, already that, broke that's Alex the, enough with the, Mickey Mouse. Like now you want to completely. The, oh, don't him even with don't even get me started on that's Mickey the, Mouse. No, don't even get me started. Don't even know it. That's the Cave of Wonders. You don't know the name of the Cave of Wonders. Alex is. Like Alex, the one. Alex poses that we do map out month. I give yeah. him a map out to do, which is what he yeah. requested of me, and he doesn't yeah. even finish the game. And the I game is like made the game. for the game is made for toddlers. If we got Aladdin. He's like, not gonna finish like that. The game. the game is made for toddlers. <laughs> it's made for people I, I, that I, I are four. Like, yeah. The game sucked. Alex, do you oh, think you would have finished finish. Aladdin? Oh yeah, yeah, I beat Aladdin. I've I actually played that one. Okay, it's not it's not map out worthy though. Oh, it's not map out worthy. I can't even. I I can't even hear this. I won't even hear this. <laughs> Too bad you did. No. Okay. Well, Aladdin can still be a contender then, Spencer. If you ever want to pick it, because Alex is beaten. Nope. Him. Off the table. <laughs> I want. I want the people watching this to know what they had, but but they can't have it. It's like I put Chuck right here. It's like there's a big for the love of God. Let us let us know in the comments if you don't give a fuck about Aladdin. <laughs> well, I know they don't give a fuck about Aladdin because nobody voted for it. But they're gonna <laughs> they they should realize that they they had an opportunity for a golden map out, a great map out, and they chose you know Kirby for some reason. You're you're manifesting this one into that into what you. Are claiming it can be. It could be awesome. It's all mindset, Spencer. It doesn't have to suck. <sighs> you're just, you're just, uh, you're just, you're just counter, you're just counter hunting at this point. All I'm saying is that we could have had Metroid Zero Mission. You know, we could have been talking about the origins of Metroid. You know, Metroid herself. That's all I'm saying. We could have been, could have been talking about the, the, Tozos and the chorizos could have been a great episode. Chorizos, I love chorizos. <laughs> yeah. The chozos and the chorizos, you know. <laughs> Grasslands. Ones. This is the first. The first Thank stage. You. Oh yeah. What's going on? Kirby's on grass. Touch grass. It's getting a little high. It. The first island is a vast open field with mostly flat terrain, simple enemies, and miles of grass. The yellow raindrop is hidden here. Got the yellow raindrop, Spencer? Uh, probably. Maybe not. Probably not. They didn't. To be honest, I just flew over most of the levels. You can fly in this game. Why? You don't have to platform at all. Why are you, dude? The last time we did Kirby, you were like, I fucking love Kirby. Now you just hate Kirby. Well, on? it's it's because is everything okay? It's because there was an option to play a better game. <laughs> yeah, Met Metroid Zero Mission. I know. What you're saying Metroid is, if, if like we mutually agreed on Kirby's Dream Line Two, you might be more optimistic. Well, I don't know. I okay. don't know. I just think that the mini boss is a freedy. Who? Ifridi. Ifridi, I barely knew you. <laughs> <laughs> Not unlike a flamer, Ifridi attempts to harm Kirby by launching himself, launching itself, sorry, pronouns, at him as a fireball, but moves slowly, so avoiding it should not be hard. <laughs> Make sure not to touch the bag suspended from the ceiling or it will harm Kirby. Wow, that sucks. 
<laughs> pronouns by, by, by launching their selves. <laughs> their, 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 their self. <laughs> their self. My, my favorite personal pronoun it. <laughs> Afridi the t- transgender mini boss. <laughs> Yeah. From Game Boy very, in 1995. Very progressive. Sakura was forward thinking. <laughs> yeah. It's very progressive. Pretty, pretty progressive, this game. Tell you what. <laughs> the transgender mini boss. It's a CEO. It's it's on its way. It's assistant CEO company. <laughs> like, we're gonna stir up my some curvy boss, boss mini boss all the time. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna stir up some curvy controversy, then Nintendo's gonna have to make a statement about this. <laughs> We've got a lot. We, we have the Arabs, we have RFK, and we have, <laughs> we have the Arabs. <laughs> <laughs> the Arabs, we have RFK and the transgender bosses. Got the Arabs. Arabs. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Just... <laughs> There's a tree. Oh, blocky. <laughs> you're saying blocky. Is that what you're saying? I'm saying that there's a oh, boss. Is, the boss is called the Wispy Woods. <laughs> it's a big tree. Okay. We've never seen no, that before. The, the mini boss was blocky. No, it's a freedy. Was that the, was that the mini boss? It's a freedy. A freedy. What the it's... fuck? Why can't I find <laughs> this mini boss? Use the strategy. Oh, they're, they're at. Oh, they're, they're, oh it's, it's, it's at the oh, section it's, labeled it's mini fuck. boss. It's this oh. fuck. I'm not looking at the thing you guys are. It's this fuck right here. Okay, I got you. Thank you, yeah. Alex. Okay, now Alex isn't using the agreed upon wiki that we all shared that we were going to use. <laughs> so that's that makes this an even better podcast. <laughs> 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 We're all over the place. <laughs> Excellent. I do my own thing, yeah. He's doing his I'm own thing today. I'm a rebel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Wispy, Wispy Woods. Wispy there Woods. There he is. There's that tree. That damn tree again. How does this look less like like it looks uglier than the other one? Than the other the original. <laughs> what do you want? Do you want it to be a beautiful tree? It's Ooh. actually pre COVID. That's why he's a face mask. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Well it's not covering his nose. No, th- that's not pre COVID. Uh, let's see, that's he's wearing it wrong. COVID. That's in COVID. As most people probably were oh. during COVID. Yeah. So there you go. That's all that tree. There we go. Wait, wait, he, that's silly. He's a tree. He can't get it. I he no, come on. Wear get your shot and get the, the uh, wear your face mask. Come on. Social distance. Mm-hmm. Quit whispering. Quit whispering around. He's a tree. He's a tree. He can't social distance. <laughs> sure he can. <laughs> can't move. You know, He's trees tree. are living beings too. They 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 can sense when things are going bad. They can sense yeah, trouble. He's not trouble's like bad. a He's not like a Wizard of Oz tree. He's like a regular tree. He's literally like a Wizard of Oz tree. He throws apples at you, no, and he's a the living Wizard creature. Of Oz move, oh, he's the true. Whisper of Oz. I guess he is a Wizard of Oz tree. <laughs> I like the well, in the, he, in the picture uh, for he this. Reverse stocks out apples, right? In the or wisps. In the picture for this, it just has a picture of the tree, and then underneath the, the it says the tree himself. <laughs> so we go back what does that us. mean? What? what? <laughs> the tree himself. Here he is. Here he is in all of his tree glory. <laughs> like we know you've been waiting. We know you've been watching. It's the tree himself, Wispy <laughs> Wood. <laughs> My God! Oh, you're on this. You're on this guy. Yes, we are. Let's go to the big it? forest. <laughs> Let's go to the last stage. Yeah, let's just let's, let's, get, let's, let's cut to the let's chase. Oh, no, 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 no. yeah. big forest, big forest. This is a big forest. It's a forest that's big. There you go. I did the whole synopsis. And the boss is N. Ruff. Is is N. Ruff? Is N. Ruff? Yeah. I kind of want Alex to call Wispy Woods Mister Woods. Mister Woods. There you go. Yeah. Mr. Woods. <laughs> Mr. Woods. Mr. Woods back. himself. <laughs> he said he didn't call anyone Mr. except for Mr. Beast. So now we have Mr. Woods. That's, damn it. Uh, now everyone knows my sucks. secret. 
my Mr. Beast. It really sucks. I'm sponsored by Mr. Beast. Everybody that sucks go out so the bar, bad. Buy some, buy some Feastables. They're delicious. Better than Hershey's chocolate Feastables. Get them now. Get them while they're. Get them while they suck. The third stage is Ripple Field. It's submerged in water. Wait, what is the second stage? What? Dark it's a woods. Big forest. The, the, the woods. The what? Big woods. Big forest. The boss. What about <laughs> The boss is rough. Rough, yeah. Remember, rough. He's rough. a little rough around the edges. He's a little rough around the edges. <laughs> <laughs> what we've officially he? entered. We've officially entered the ten minute zone. We have ten minutes to end the episode. Let's go. <laughs> what is and rough? <laughs> That's his name. That's how Alex likes it. <laughs> it's a name. Yes. What is or he? or her name? <laughs> <laughs> or its name. Just their name. We just <laughs> we'll, he will fight you in a room. He has a gender. Okay. Gender confirmed. <laughs> gender assumed, I say. <laughs> well, I guess the strategy wiki assumed it. Yeah. Dangerous. Does Ed Ruffle mainly attack you? I think it's more of a manly attack, you. <laughs> Man rough. <laughs> In roof, <laughs> just the female version and meow. Oh, he's a boar. Ripple field, ripple field. Here we go. Oh, Underwater, you, you didn't like him. He sucked. Oh, he's oh, boring. Oh my god, 15. <laughs> it's like 20. I'm just saying 15. They can call me out if they want. In the chat. Oh my gosh. It's underwater. Squeeze you 10 need... more suck jokes in there. Come on. You're going to need Kine, guys. the fish. Remember him? He swims. Yeah. yeah. I like him. Swimmers and a sucker. I got some swimmers. Yeah. Really interesting stage <laughs> design here. Yeah. yeah it's underwater. You know, we love Some those water those... stages. Every every platformer has got to have a water stage. Yeah. Oh my gosh, the boss is sweet stuff. Is he? Ooh. <laughs> I don't want that Wait, to be he, Alex. I don't know. What is the... I want that to be Alex's deal. He just says, oh my god, the boss is... And then names the boss. How <laughs> 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 more about sweet stuff, Alex? <laughs> All right, we're on stage four. Oh my god, the boss is rough. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, did you miss me? No, if, no, no. If we're on, uh, if we're on stage four, of the oh my god, the boss is ice dragon. <laughs> it's like I really like the fastest way to speed through this map. <laughs> Today we're playing Kirby's Dream Land. Oh my god, the boss is King Dedede. Holy shit! <laughs> Holy shit! Holy this shit. is not the real true final boss. Holy true final boss is Aladdin. Is. Oh my god, Damn, it's the GD. It's the GD. <laughs> The genie, it's the genie Jaf uh, Jafar, right? Genie Jafar. It's Robin Williams, get him! <laughs> <laughs> Robin Williams back from the dead, <laughs> and he's still doing it, coke. It's Patch Adams. <laughs> get, get, it's Patch Adams. get him! <laughs> get him! Scaring <laughs> <laughs> cancer with his jokes. Uh. Sweet stuff is a, is a fish. It's an angler I'm fish. On I'm on the road five okay. already. Um, back. <laughs> Come on back, Alex. Come on, bring it on back. Come on. All right, all right. I won't tell you who the boss is for road five. But holy, okay. but, oh my God, it's. Oh, oh my God, you won't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> you will not believe. <laughs> boss from Kirby's Dream Land 2, stage five. Uh, but once, not gonna believe it. once you beat the fish, you you go from water to ice. What? What is sweet stuff? An angler fish. What's an angler fish? The, the it's like a the, fish, but it's like a 90 degree angle. <laughs> I don't think that's it. Oh. <laughs> it's the one with the little glowy bit on his head, right? That's like a, a, a lantern fish. I don't know if that's correct uh, that's <laughs> I, a, also know, that's a I also don't know enough about fish to argue <laughs> well I just googled it that's called a glowy head fish that's what those are called oh, glowy head fish. wow wow that clo that comes up in google glowy head fish mm -hmm. if you google it right now you'll see it paralyze I use a different google 
Uh, the next one is Arizona. Yeah. Is Kirby's? Oh, yeah. It's Kirby's Dream Land Two is the game, but but the, the level, <laughs> the level though is called Iceberg. Oh my God! The boss is Ice Dragon. You're gonna need Rick. Rick, you need Rick for this one because he doesn't skid on the ice. He doesn't suck uh, on the ice. What if I on choose ice? Morty? Ricardo on ice. Ricardo on ice. <laughs> now presenting Ricardo <laughs> at your lo- at your local civic center. Ricardo on ice. Ricardo on ice. <laughs> Come see him skate in the beautiful figure eight. <laughs> this weekend only. <laughs> <laughs> Sunday, Sunday, What's Sunday. The <laughs> opportunity. <laughs> Bring the family to see Ricardo on ice. <laughs> you'll pay for the chair, but you'll only need the edge. <laughs> it's just one guy on the, the ice <laughs> it's, it's, it's three hours long. He's majestic. <laughs> He's beautiful. Ricardo presents and memorializes Latino and Latina culture on ice. <laughs> He's got maracas. <laughs> He's just skating those little maracas. <laughs> In his nacho hat. He'll eat he'll eat the nachos while he's skating, doing a backflip. This week this week the special presentations for the Arabs. <laughs> no, no, the Arabs only. Because Arabs only by the Arab Emirates. <laughs> Arabs on ice. Oh my god, an ice we dragon. Oh my god. There he is. Did you say he's a nice dragon? Not this one. <laughs> <laughs> He's mean, and it sucks. <laughs> Holy fuck! Four or five? Take it away. Oh my god, it's Go Mr. Shine and Mr. Bright. They have pronouns. They're misters. I could have sworn one of them was a female. No. I was wrong. There are a couple, and you should leave them alone. Don't judge them. This is where wow, actually... That's very like, like real talk, this, this game actually got hard here. Oh, I don't want to. This game is made for toddlers, Spencer. Yeah, I mean, I'm not saying I didn't beat it, but like, it actually there's some challenges. Poor toddlers. No, it wasn't. Come back to me when you can beat Mickey Uh, Mouse the game. I don't want to beat your shitty Mickey Mouse game. It's not even the best Mickey Mouse game. It's like the worst one. Well, then beat it. These bosses are celestial, meaning they're out of this world. Cloudy Park. Cracko! <laughs> there he is! There's Cracko. Yeah! <laughs> Holy it. shit! It's it comes full circle. Oh my god. Cracko confirmed. Uh, page seven is Dark Castle. Yeah. What? That's all you have for Cracko. Cracko, Put some you respect on this man's name. I love Cracko. Don't do never insinuate that I don't love Cracko again. Well, if you love Cracko, how about some Cracko tr- trivia for you? <laughs> okay, give me some Cracko trivia. What does it say under his picture in the strategy wiki that we're using? <laughs> it says, I have to go back a page. It says two things. <laughs> this will this will prove if he is on the same wiki. <laughs> yeah, it's Cracko Junior's form, and then the other one says, uh, "Now he means business." That's right. God damn it. I was already looking at DD. Maybe go back. Has a business degree. Okay, another trivia question. What are the miniature crackos called? Junior. Crackheads. They're also on the Crackheads. Strategy with me. I'm going with crackheads. I'm not going back anymore. I'm 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 going with crackheads. Oh, co crackos. They're called Co Crackos. Coke Crackos. Co Crackos. Is Cracko a crackhead? Crackpot? I never seen him outside of a, is it a corporation home. of crack crack co. Oh, we learn more about mm. the lore, the Kirby lore. Yeah, I, I can't support that. I can only support Mr. Beast Feastables. You can get them <laughs> at your local Walmart or your local gas station. They are delicious, better, better than Hershey's chocolate. Get them now. <laughs> yeah, what if it says crack co on the back? Dark matter confirmed. Wow. Dark matter. Part of the saga. Oh, wait, hold on. When you, when you when you spell dark matter backwards, you get D D D. 
Dark Castle, the last Dracula. stage in the game. Dracula. <laughs> <laughs> it's cracky. Dark Castle. We have the crack king himself. King DDD. Oh my god. He's this like this is a tough fight. This is tricky. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you can't you don't have any copy abilities, right? In this one, so kind of hard. Never use them anyway. The D. All right, well, that's Kirby Streamland too. That was Great it, job, guys. That was the episode. It says the end? Question mark? Yes. Okay, yeah. <laughs> let's, let's, let's turn it off. <laughs> so, what do you? What do you guys? What are your takeaways? Um. Uh, Wario Land is a great game for the gameplay. I don't know if our viewers have ever heard a podcast like this before. That's that, that's my takeaway. Uh, Mr. Feast Feastables, Mr. Beast Feastables, Mr. Feast Beastables, <laughs> Mr. Beast, <laughs> Mr. Feast Beastables. <laughs> Mr. Feast is a great are spin-off now, channel, by the way. That's are, are now good. available at Walmart and other stores. Go buy them. They're better than the Hershey's chocolate. <laughs> you know, you I'm keep saying that. Paid. I'm so not weird. being paid to say that. <laughs> Unironically, I want Mr. Feast as our next mascot. He already can you is. Put up a picture? Can you put a picture of Mr. Feast? I can't, unfortunately. Can you try? We got to. We got to talk to our. Can you at least try? We got to talk to our guests now, so we got to say bye. Least... Yeah, I'll, I'll give you my takeaways. Okay. It's that you guys wish you won. No, Spencer wishes he won. No, no, no. And I'll, I'll, if you no, want, I don't to, think, if you want see, to go I don't that think route, you felt that way originally, Alex. But because Spencer fought so hard for his pick during this episode, it rubbed off on you as well. No, I, I was mocking him. I, I, I was doing it in a mocking tone. If you want to go that low, if you want to, to to go on that that low road, then guess what? I think, I think the people that watch this are going to realize that they made a mistake. But the problem is that they realize it too late. And so now they're going to suffer the consequences for it. But I can't. The, best, epi- right the best episode we've ever recorded. That's their mistake. Well, that that remains to be seen. I found Mr. Feast. Are you guys oh, ready? Show. Yes. Go out on this. <laughs> <laughs> he likes the chocolate bars. They're good, yeah. bar, they're good chocolate bars. That, that- that's Mr. Feet because he eats a chocolate bar in like every video now. So that's Mr. Feast in like 20 years. Look like that. Anyway, later, yeah, boys. the current controversy. So <laughs> have a great day, everyone. We'll see you in Final Fantasy, Wary. Hi. <laughs>